day four. <laughs> it's October 4th. I'm at a friend's house right now. Um, we're just sort of having a campfire and their older kids are in there playing video games and everything, but I just thought I'd do a little bit of update. This is probably going to be really short because I haven't really had a chance to do anything. It's been a real fussy day with Jaden, but I'm out at a campfire. There'll be a little bit of campfire footage and that'll be it. So um, I'll probably add a little bit more of an explanation to the end. Thanks. Like it just my seems as extreme as medication. I'm giving my kids six or seven or eight supplements. Adderall or... Well, they're but the kinds too. like they're getting in these groups? Mm -hmm. so no, I guess they're the, getting vitamins. The question well, is... Well, that's different. If they're, if they're, what's they're the difference between, between 15, 16 different supplements and, say, a vaccine? The vaccine is more researched. Well, I'm not, I don't know what to say about a vaccine, but, but to do something more comparable, Adderall or... Uh, risk for doll, right? Which is my current battle. Well, that was <laughs> one that a lot of them have tried those and they didn't work. The one that but may get eliminated. Works. Frankly, I think you get to a certain point when you have a kid that that is completely consuming your life with their issues. I don't think they care. I think if somebody was like, "Here, I have this medication and it will work," right. I think they'd be like, "Sweet, I'll give my kid this drug and it will work." So, I but guess there's no drug that fixes autism. 